Jake from Zcode and in this video I want to talk to you about live betting. So the question people mainly ask me is how can I get started and what exactly is live betting? So to answer your question live betting is very simple. It is betting on a match which is already in progress. Um, all of the bets that we release in Zcode uh, are posted in the live betting room and you will know when it's activated because it's going to going to appear in the right hand side of the window and you're going to see here I've actually activated the betting room just so we can show it in the video. This betting room is not active when there is no bets obviously so you may not always see it. Um, sometimes people post live bets on the Zcode, Zcode uh, wall which is here. You may spot some live bets from other experts um, but the main ones are obviously going to appear in the live betting room. Experts that do live betting within Zcode are Brandon, myself, obviously Jake, Will, Vincent, Otarias, Bear, Rowan, Luke77, Gonzalez, Marina, Delboy, Pietro and Dragon, just to name a few. Um, these live bets are very frequent within the Zcode community. You will spot a lot of them popping up on the wall almost every single day, all day long to be honest, because bettors, bettors from Zcode community always find the new lines and obviously it's a 365, uh, <laughs> 365 betting opportunities all year round. Uh, so just to show you some examples of how you can analyze those live bets and where you can find them. My favorite website is Flashscore. This is where you can uh, track all of the matches which are taking place. For example, let's just say football, live games, and this is all you can see. You can click onto one of those games and then you can go into odds. Usually it's going to show you the live betting odds sometimes for the more popular games. Not for this one at, at least, but um, perhaps this. Ah, there we go. Live bots. In this case, it's only bet 365. I think it's because the match is just about to end and they're not getting enough feed. But this is my favorite website. This is where you can find all the scores and the odds for those matches as well. You can obviously change the settings uh, once you log in, I believe, or register on this website. You can change the odds and <clears throat> change some of the standard settings, like GMT, for example, uh, time zone. And this is my other website. It's called Odds Portal. I really like it for tracking in play odds, analyzing matches, and everything in general, to be honest. So let's just say into Let's just go into one of those live matches. Giron versus Elias. In play odds are visible here. And these are all of the bookmakers which are taking live bets right now. And um, these are mainly European bookmakers, but you may find some U US bookmakers as well, which do accept live bets. So you can see a wide range of bets. You can track all of them. So if you're unsure about a live bet which is released within Zcode, always check on Odds Portal just to be sure. You can see all of the odds are live and they're changing continuously. So this is one thing that you are going to experience within live betting. Let's just go into this match. I have it open here. Um, especially in tennis and I suppose basketball as well. Uh, as the match progresses, the odds are going to be changing after every single point. So here we have 15-15. Once the next point is played and whoever wins it, the odds are probably going to go down on Giron from 153 down to perhaps 150. And the odds on Gastao Elias are going to go up to 240 possibly. So when you're doing live betting, you obviously have to just look out for the odds, try to analyze the matches. Well, I was, I was, I wasn't too close to that. <laughs> Cause the earliest one. So, just to just to show you um, the 
the odds have changed drastically in this match. It also depends on the amount of data that Bookmaker has on the actual player. Believe it or not, um, if this was a person who doesn't lose many points and wins a lot, perhaps goes into tie breaks, the odds are not going to change as much as they do on this player, for example. He doesn't ace much. Um, he's throwing a bit of a double faults here and there. So it is a lot harder for, for him to win a point. Therefore, the odds change more drastically when he wins one. You obviously can bet on other sports as well. Soccer is the biggest one, obviously. Um, I'm just giving you an example on Bet365, but this is basically what's happening. You can change the overview. Sometimes it gets very chaotic to watch uh, all of these bets, but if you're looking for something within Z code, you can press Command F in my case because I'm on a MacBook. But if you are on a normal computer, I believe it's a Control F to look for things, look for words. For example, someone has posted a bet on Giron type his name in, you're gonna find him here. And it, that's the easy way to find bets. Uh, as you know, the odds change quickly, so when someone releases a bet, you have to act quickly. So in order to find the match you're looking for, I recommend using Command F, Control F to find the matches um, based on what was released. Guys, thank you so much for watching and I hope this clears up a lot of information for you. I hope the video was very um, educational and I hope you start using live bets because it is very profitable and you can take a lot of advantages from that. Thank you so much for watching.